What's up everyone? Welcome to the stream. My name is David Sinair and we are once again back to the Walking Dead Telltale Collection or whatever this is called. And um, we just finished season one. However, we're going back to it because there's a sixth episode that was previously DLC which is 400 days and uh, we have not played that one yet so that's what's next and then we're gonna start season two because that's what's after that so let's uh let's go how are you doing Sai? oh start episode six it doesn't say Continue. Okay. Well, let's do it. 400 days. Season 1 of The Walking Dead. Should get some different headphones sometime. Not enjoying these when they're pretty broken. Didn't they say how many days were passed? Well, I think Vince was the first one. I told you. I already told you it wasn't me, man. Man, come on. I told you like like 20 times. Uh, I don't even I don't even know your brother. Right, we're starting with Vince, clearly a good guy. Sam is going to have back problems when he's older? You bet! And, uh... And, like, arm problems, too. Damn, listen to this crap anymore. Two hours. 
Think it'll clear up soon? Wait a minute, the traffic man? It was supposed to have been at the pen an hour ago. I'm gonna get written up for this. Traffic's Relax. still backed up for miles. It's not your fault. Never thought I'd want to get to prison. What the hell, man? What? You know. Cut it out. Jesus, you guys. You gonna make me? Yeah. Hey, Vince! Justin's gonna make me! It's too hot for this shit. Vince! I'm making him hot now! Yeah, Danny, you're making me hot. Settle down, assholes. He started it. Hey, man. How about you open a fucking window? It's a prison bus, asshole. The windows hey, don't Justin, open. Hey, Justin, see right, that guy man. in the beat-up truck? Right. I bet Shut he lives in that there. truck now. You probably got his whole house. Life savings. Shit, I bet you stole his dog. You steal his dog, man? I wasn't stealing from guys like that. Anyway, better than stealing his virginity. Hey, how many times I gotta tell you? Here we go. Seriously, I was falsely accused. How old was she, 15? Damn it, it ain't like that. You telling me there wasn't a star witness waiting around in your white van? I'm shocked. You were convicted, Danny. Gotta admit that much. Oh, come on, Vince. That don't mean I did it. My lawyer's gonna be here. Tell about you what, this. guys. I ain't afraid to say it. I'm really it. missing my girlfriend right now. I'm oh, guessing she's pretty pissed nerve, at you. Man. It's I worse swear, than that, man. She won't talk to me. Mouth. I haven't heard her voice in months. She's really messing with me, like for real. Just let it go, man. I want to, but you know. I love her, man. What's it matter, man? You're headed to jail. Never heard of a conjugal visit? Danny, I know you don't realize this because you're you, but you probably ruined that poor girl's life, you piece of shit. Big talk from White Collar back there. How many lives you wrecked, kid? Who cares? How did the hell up in here? I'm getting dehydrated. Night's no, not a vibe. What? Water back here? Shut I thought you took the there. stand and cried your eyes out. I'm telling you again. Didn't you lose your shit and tell them you didn't know what you were doing? Or I'll set you I lied. Turns out I'm good at that. You lied on the stand? See, that's the kind of shit I could never do. Religious? No, nah, man. Watch a lot of cop shows? Nope. What then? It just ain't right. Oh, give me a break. It's a tough call. Why do more time than you need to? Gotta stay clean, man. Says the criminal. You wanna know the funny thing? I don't regret any of it. I carried my victims for years. They knew what they were getting into. And now here I am, and there they are. And Wall Street assholes pulling the same scores are smiling on TV. Fuck that. How did it all work, anyway? It was like, uh, a pyramid scheme. Aren't those kind of shit? It was a really good pyramid scheme. Hey, if nobody got hurt, no harm done. They'll get their money back. Most of it. How much did you make off with, anyway? Enough. So, like, a couple hundred K? A little over a hundred. Million. God damn, boy. Oh, when we get out of here, you, me, and Vince, we gotta go into business, know what I'm saying? You know, I don't actually know a thing about you, Vince. Maybe he's a priest. Yeah, Father Vincent. I bet he touched a kid. I helped my little brother. They send you to prison for that now? He was in trouble. I had to... Help him out. I knew it was something stupid. You regret it, man? If you're saying what I think you are, I got respect for you, man. But that's a hard thing to carry, you know? Every day. But what are you gonna do? Yeah, I feel you. How'd they get you? Tossed the gun up on a roof. And? It was a good throw, and a roofer found it the next day. You, know, you gotta be kidding me. Man, you're bad luck, Vince. Bad luck, Vince! <laughs> That's not bad. What do you think, Justin? What the fuck are you gonna do about fuck it? you? Fuck me? <laughs> fuck you, motherfucker! Oh, Jesus oh, Christ! What the hell is going on? Crabtree, knock it off! Hey, get in there, man! Hey, let him go, man! Damn it, Crabtree! Don't make me come back! He's gonna kill him, Vince! Let the guard handle it, guys. Fuck that! We gotta get in there! You do not want to get in the middle of that shit, Danny. Vince, we gotta do something. You know this ain't right. 
I'm not doing any more time to save some stupid ass. Where's your empathy, man? What? Help him, Danny. What's that? Speak up, boy. I can't hear you. chain's too short. Crabtree, I'm warning you one He's last listening, time, goddammit. You, you gotta get in get there. Get yourself in there and wake that shit up, Come on, now. man. Come on, boy. Get back there. Okay, asshole. Let him go. Get in between them, goddammit. He's gonna kill that boy. Crabtree? Last what warning. Do for? I said do let him go, goddammit. Nailed it. Doing a shit night. What the fuck was that? Oh, Jesus. Can't be dependent on man. drinking, man. What did you do, boy? God damn it, boy. Answer damn. me back there. That guy's there. still alive. Get those cuffs off him, man. Boy. <laughs> what the hell was that? He, he made a move on me. He made a move, or you don't know. Which one? <coughs> He's still breathing. <coughs> He's uh. Fucking fuck! <coughs> you, you gotta call someone, man. What? I'm calling this in. Don't, don't call it in yet. Just, just wait, okay? Just give me a damn minute. You killed that guy. You gotta deal with it, man. I just need a minute. I need a minute to think. You ain't got a minute. Shut up! You hear me? Just shut your mouth. Okay, okay. Calm down. Take it easy. Quit waving that thing around before you get someone else killed. Oh, you gonna get smart with me now? Vince! It's okay. Just back off. We all need to take it down a notch. You really want to pull that trigger again, son? You know, I bet everyone thinks that. The it ain't long term thing. What the fuck? That's how it starts. Don't do it. Did you see that? I saw Running that. away is the worst. Yeah. Hey, you gotta get us the hell out of here. You're not going anywhere. Fuck that. Get this bus moving. Hey, drive. I said Let's go, we're man. staying right here. We're safe inside the bus. Nothing's gonna hold it. Jesus. Oh my god. Hey. Hey, you need to call someone. You hear me? We need to. Did he just bail on us? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> What's up, babe? I love throwing. Thank you for the bits. Fuck, fuck, fuck. How are you doing? He can't reach us. You sure about that? That ankle's gonna get. Shit. What are we doing, guys? Come on. We gotta do something. I'm trying to think. Better think fast, man. To find a weapon. What kind of weapon? Where's the guard's gun? Yeah, yeah, the gun. Good thinking, Justin. Where the fuck is it? I think he fell on it. It's underneath. Oh, so did you watch the video? Did you enjoy it? Get the gun, man. Get up, Vince. Hurry up. Did it inspire you to make a purchase? Man. Don't negotiate with terrorists. Sorry. Man, I can't believe this shit. Can you believe this shit, man? No. We gotta find some way to get out of here. Hello, Arrow. How are you? Damn it. What are you doing? Can't do anything until we get out of these damn chains. Maybe he's got the keys on him. Nothing. Well, shit, if the keys aren't on him, then where the hell are they? He must have left them up front. Maybe we finally caught a break. Danny, Hey, no. buddy! What the fuck? God damn it, Danny. You always put your fucking foot in you, man. You gotta get out of here before any more of them show up. You gotta remove one with a single twin bed you're coming to. Fire the fucking gun! Uh-oh. Take out the windows. Point. Vince, shoot those crazy fucks. Try the. 
I think you just pissed them off. Yeah. Yeah, save the shells. How the hell are we gonna get out There's of here? There's gotta be a way. Can't we just shoot off the chains? No way. Wouldn't cut through. What about the cuff? If we shoot one of those off, the chain will slip right out. Are you fucking insane? What do you think is gonna happen if you fire a shotgun that close to someone's foot? Well, what do you think is gonna happen if we don't get the fuck out of here? Vince, give me the gun. We gotta do this. Back off. Vince, what the fuck? Hey, I know you're a good guy. I'm sorry, man. Fuck you! Do it! Hurry! Justin's just gonna slow you down. Do it again! Come on, let's go! You would have fucked my ass. Maybe. He's a rapist. I don't want him around. Three dudes in a twin bed. You all can recreate the one scene in plain strains and automobiles? I have not seen that. What? What is it? They just shot off a dude's foot to escape. It's like he's on a mission to convert the monster in a very gamey place. You need to do it! Otherwise you don't escape. So next one is white. <laughs> I wouldn't be opposed to watching some movies. Did I miss? Shoot that guy, man. What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do it. It just happened. It's like I was saying the other day. Like I, I, I saw that commercial for American Pie on TV, and I was like, hmm. I have never watched American Pie, and that seems like a movie that everyone has watched, and that probably was really important for my own generation. Never seen American Pie. <laughs> yeah, none Are you of them. Okay? Where the fuck were you with a warning? You're putting that on me now? I didn't see the guy either. I was too worried those dudes were gonna pull guns on us. Shit, dude, they catch up to us. Who gives a shit? Just hurry up, Eddie. Here, man, shoot. Dude, take this thing. Get him, man. Japanese pie. Jeez. That that's not a thing. Holy shit, man! Did you get them? Are they back there? Wyatt, dude, are they there or not? Come on! Wyatt, talk words at me, man. Maybe they crashed. I didn't hear a crash. Did you hear a crash? No, no, I didn't. Here, here, I'll turn off. <laughs> but hey, I, I realize I probably should have seen it. Feel that look on me, man. 
I'm not being an asshole. I'm being smart. No lights, no, uh, you know, they can't see us. Christ, I can taste blood in my mouth. I don't think it's mine. I can't see a damn thing out here. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense, Wyatt. God, I can't believe we're in this shit. Don't barf just yet, okay? Please, this road is really straight. We'll be fine. At least slow down. What? Fuck no. Did you see that one guy's eyes? He's going down? really He's slow. Gorked. I don't want that guy in my life, Wyatt. What if there's something in the road? Doesn't matter. We gotta get the fuck away from those guys. They are A-grade fucking mental. Let there be light, huh? Dude, shut up. Senior Japanese pie? This nine-year-old girl in Yakuza is flirting with me because I did really well in racing because Japan <laughs> just likes you as a senpai. It's not flirting. Road straight as my dick. Think we're in the clear? Don't talk about your dick. Why not? <laughs> All right, let's Tom Cruise out of here. Please never talk again. See if there's still any sticky in the glove box. Remember when TJ got high and tried to put a pancake in the CD player? No. It's foggy. Oh my God! What? Shut up. see anything dude it's in there look harder I don't see it what I do see is that ammo that you lost last week oh my god really but is there any weed you know one time I was going out with this girl right Abigail you remember her and she told me that when she was five I think her dad took her to the circus sideshow they walked around for a while saw the chick with the egg loading the gun is probably more important right this second thanks Okay. Weird, but okay. Shit! Ah! <sighs> it's not flirting. Is that why they did the Yakuza Porn music they didn't see him? Is that why she says he was going to be my girlfriend? Yeah, in the future, when she grows older. Is that why she said she was going to give me the most important thing a girl can give a guy and then did the crash zoom on my crotch? Oh, holy shit. That, one's a, that one is the only dubious one. The other ones I think are like... Like the porn music is for... Uh, could be for comedy. Because that game Stone is uh, comedic in those instances but the the zoom on the crotch and the giving you the, the most important thing that's a little icky yes you're right i will tell you that this time you are right see i know i know when i'm wrong holy shit dude holy shit did you get a look i think that was a guy wyatt Come on, man, say something. Was that a You're always right. See, that's not true. I'm not agreeing now. Fog. This night is so fucked, man. It didn't look human, alive, whatever. Really? Seriously? I mean, seriously? Look me in the eyes and say that. You heard me, Eddie. Let's see if there's anything around the car. You know, anything that'll like tell us one way or the other. That way we can just book. But I'm not leaving if we hit a human being, man. I'm just not. Man, don't roll it down broken. I can't see through the cracks. Look, it's fine, see? Dude, what's that on the broken side mirror? It's clearly a potato. Does that blood look fresh to you? Yeah, but it's kind of dark. Yeah. Damn. You think that blood on the windshield is fresh or rotten? 
Is that the mirror from the car? Can't tell from here. What's that way out in the road? It's part of a shirt, I think. Yeah, but plenty of dead guys have shirts on. Keep looking. Man, I'm really not seeing anything. Seriously, you think some piece of that guy made it into the glove box? Man, yep. I don't know. Because we've got the radio, too. Around. We need to know what's going on, okay? That's not going to help. Okay, okay. Jeez. Well, anime is dope. I can tell you that. It was a guy. Are you sure? Yes. How sure? Pretty fucking sure. Don't fuck with Tiny Carlos, sure. Jesus. So what do we do? What do you mean, what do we do? We go out there. What about the guys in the truck? Man, fuck those guys. If that guy back there is alive, we have to help him, Wyatt. There ain't a lot of live dudes left these days. Why don't we just drive back and maybe run him over again in the fog? He can't be that far back, man. Come on, man. This is stupid. We go out there, we check it out, we get moving. Both of us? I mean, I don't know. Me? I hit the fucking guy. One of us should stay here, though, in case. Okay. Well. Shit. Okay. Here, we'll rock, paper, scissors for it. Are you fucking serious? No. Come on. Sitting here is making me nervous. No way, man. You're nuts. I'm clear as shit, Wyatt. This is the only way it's fair. Hey, you, you're the one that wants to go out. You shot that guy back there. You hit that thing in the road. None of that shit is my fault. All right. I'll go. That's okay. That makes sense. Okay. Just go out there. Take a look. Sitting here stalling isn't going to help you feel any better. You're the one that wanted to do this. I'm scared, Wyatt. Come on, man. Please. I'll go if I lose, I swear. Forget it. You want to go out there, that's your business. I'll wait right here where it's safe. Looks like it's me. It is. <sighs> oh my god. We need to start having... Uh, uh, Alcoholics Anonymous... Um, gathering over here. It's hearty, it's throw. Who else? There's more people that say that. You're town drunk as well. It's cyan. Here, in case we need to get out of here quick. Can't run out tonight. Tonight I can forget about. Hey, Wyatt. I ate yeah, I like I said. Going. Shit, where the hell do they go? It's the smallest hoopty in the world. Alcoholics Anonymous. There you are, you piece of shit. How they get roped into this? Alcoholism. To work tomorrow, so no drinks tonight. I'm staying right here. Why didn't he just leave them in the ignition? Shit! Ah! That's something I've never understood. Like, problems are still there. Just pretending they don't exist doesn't help at all. Can only fix one, then fix it. Focus on what you can fix and uh, ignore what you can't fix. Say fuck it.
I don't care. Practice the art of not giving a fuck. It's uh it's it's my it's my only uh thing I wanna do this year. Also build a better studio, but I, I already bought that shit. Can't wait for it to arrive. So that's that's already in, in place. Oh, I'll fix. <laughs> Surrounding myself with lumens. <laughs> Yeah, that's one thing, like, okay, this is something that's completely outside of your control. You can't, uh, you can't stress about it, like, accept what, what's happening. Time to make some poop bombs. I don't know what that means. Got like 60 miles left, I think. Ain't shit. I know it's easy to to just say it and and uh, other people's problems are easier on uh, are are the easiest, right? Only ours are are bad. But um, but it's true, like you. You can't you can't spend all your time worrying about something that's completely outside of your control. You're going to drive yourself crazy about it. Oh, EX grenades number two, yeah. Hey, use them on humans, man. It's funny. Throw it where they're going to walk. Hey, you getting up? Good. Should probably hurry. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, Carly. Wait. What? There's trophies. This this episode has its all its trophies. Oh. Fuck, then I should have played the... I should have played, um, whatever. Rock, paper, scissors. I keep thinking of the name in Japanese! See myself guitar helps when I ain't got no alcohol. <laughs> I see you cuddling with your girlfriend down there. Bought one recently. Cool, cool, cool. That's amazing. See, that's a good thing to do. I don't want no trouble. Please. You just want to be left alone with your friend down there? No, just leave me alone. Look, I don't care what you do to whatever corpse you find. I wasn't. What's your name? Don't matter. What? You don't like the name Russell? Well, maybe that's just the name of the guy you or your homies robbed, huh? I don't care who you steal from, if you did. Maybe you're in a gang that likes to rob people. I don't know. Are you in a crew? You got some boys wearing hoodies I gotta worry about? Because you steal from me and I'll get your throat out. I don't care who you run around with, you understand? It's mine. I didn't steal it. All right, good. I don't like thieves. Just get in the car. 
You're gonna get eaten out here otherwise, and I'm bored. Come on, scoot. Ain't gonna wait forever. Nah, I'm good, thanks. I don't want to ride. Jesus, don't be so damn sensitive. I said I'm good. Fine. Doesn't even have a weapon. Hell yeah, get in, let's tear it up. Name's Nate, by the way, thanks for asking. You thirsty? Uh here you go. I'm straight, thanks. You're not uptight, are you? Is this the fucking apocalypse? This is like Nothing. No, I'm just good, all right? All right, all right. You want to tell me about where you come from, at least? Must have been with a crew. Any tailback where you come from? Maybe drop you off and do a double back. Can we just drive? We? Oui. You want to sit on my lap? I just don't want to talk. You're a tough little nut, Russ. Look, man, I'm sorry if I freaked you out at first. We all got our way of coping with shit, right? I guess I can come across a bit. Ah, whatever. Crass. Yes. There you go. Relax. We're gonna have some fun. Why don't you tell me where you were before you got here? Fine. There were seven of us. I didn't have any family there. Enough. They're all at my grand's down in Statesboro. There was a dad who had a daughter about my age. One guy said he used to be a cop, but nobody really believed him. And a teacher and his wife. The leader was this guy, Steve. Go back to the daughter. Steve was a bad dude, but everybody was with him, you know? He said seven was the magic number, so he didn't add nobody to the group. We found survivors, it was the same every time. He. He. Let it out, Paco. Just. We gonna kill these folks and take this stuff or what? Then bang, they'd be dead. Anyway, I, I couldn't handle that. After weeks of it, I packed my shit up and figured I could make for Grands alone and try to find my family. Damn, falling asleep here. I out of there. <laughs> couldn't live like that. So nobody got down with the daughter then? No, they didn't. Who did you get? Strong six. Just tell me something about her. How was the rat? Give me a little something. Just a taste. Russ, I'm doing you a service here. I gotta get my beak wet. I put it right in here. Why you gotta be like that? Like what? Always talking about women like that. Women? <laughs> okay, well, let, let me see if I can answer your question. Because, because the hunger a man's got for a woman is all we got left now. No laws, no jobs, ain't nothing that makes us men. But they ain't eating all the women yet. Whatever. Let's try this again. <laughs> all right. Still an alcoholic. So near and dear to your heart, then. What the fuck? Come on. Scale of one to ten. What do you think? Ah, slamming before she was wrong, right? I think. Here, get a look. Fuck! Like a knife, right? Get off me! Maybe you got high standards. Oh, if you say five, I'm gonna slip. Tell me, Russ. Yes. Jesus, Russ, calm down. Damn it. Would you load that? Bullets in the glove there.
Yeah, just because you know what's good doesn't mean you're not uh, completely wasted. But uh, as far as I know from hearsay, because I haven't been drunk ever, uh, being drunk makes everything better. Like the music's better and uh, the stuff tastes better or whatever. Let's look for some supplies in here. See if we can fill up while we're at it. Don't be mad. Fine, be mad. Just stop being a pussy. I. Oh shit! Go! Get out! Contrary to what David just said, he's drunk all the time. It's a reality. Nope. Get to the truck. I'll cover you. I'm sure there's no gas anymore. You got bullets this time? Don't think about it. Just run. I'll keep his fucking head down. Good hustle. What happened to I'll cover you? Look how good you did. I shouldn't have come with you. Well, it's too fucking late now. You need to relax, Russell. Come on, kid. Look at me. Russell, get your shit together. There is no getting out of this right now, okay? Okay. Now help me out here. First, we're gonna figure out exactly where this asshole is. Just get a quick glance. So I think better for a few hours and after a certain age get on oh, goers. Looking forward to that age. Hmm. He won't hit us. Come on. <laughs> Alcohol cross song. That sounds good. Push this truck for cover. Okay. It's in neutral. Just keep your head down. Shit! Just keep pushing! Shit! Push! Uh, end of the road. What now? gonna get around the side of the building. We gotta go from cover to cover. Seriously this time. I'm fucking around. You gonna cover me? If we get to that car, we'll be out of the line of fire. Here. You can cover me first. I'm not fucking around. You cover me, then I'll cover you. Or if you wanna go first, that's fine too. I'll cover you. You go first. Just shoot at the window and keep that fucker's head down till I get where I'm going. Then throw me the gun, and I'll do the same. Ready? Yeah. You ready, Russ? Cover my ass now. Don't stop shooting. Fire! All right, throw me the gun, and I'll cover you. Get in around back. Sneak up on this asshole. Follow me. Granola, raisins, or dates? Wow. Man, what are we doing? Well, we gotta get in there. Fucker shot at us. Russell, relax, man. 
When this is over, we're gonna take what we can, head on down to your grams, and have a big old home-cooked meal, all right? Come on. Cereal, two sausage rolls, two chicken burgers from KFC, then a wrap from McDonald's with six nu nuggets, large fries, and drink. Wow. I am glad I don't eat that much. I'd be penniless. You should put it out of its misery. It's fucking dead. Come on. Feel like a big man now? Let's go. Okay, it's clear. Yeah, throw. This could be just a a, a, a small girl trying to be cute. See if there's anyone else. The other thing you said is worse than this. I think I saw a guy. No shit. Grab him. I'll cover you. Do I sneak up? Just jump out and grab him. Your call. Nah, it's, it's just because I've seen that and culturally, like, small girls are, do, do tend to treat uh, older people like that. Get the fuck out of here, you monsters! Whoa, Gramps! I told you not to come back here! Think you could just leave your mask at home? And now you're with this fucking spook! First off, what hey. is the fucking racism? This is my boy! Secondly... I don't fucking know you. We were just passing by like anyone else. Bullshit! You came back to finish us off and take all our food! You've lost your goddamn marbles. She's dying, and now she can see your face. We've never been here, sir. Then who shot my wife? Wasn't us. You tried to kill us for no goddamn reason. If anything, we should take you out for that. Please, just get the fuck out of here. Please leave us alone. What do you say, Russ? Should we just kill these folks and take all their stuff? Are you serious? Maybe. Why not? That's fucked up! There are real fucking monsters out there! No shit. And you're just gonna joke about the shit I seen! Fuck you, Nate! I saved your ass! You didn't do shit! Easy, Russ. I'm not hurting no one. And don't you hurt these people either. Come on. Can we still be friends? No. That's not true, Throw. I said the other thing you said was bad. And what, uh, what Arrogance mentioned, like, if it's older people talking to younger people, it's... that's... that's... no, no. If it's the kid, ignore it. Kids being kids. AKA kids being dumb. Because that's what kids are, so kids being kids. Okay, got one. 
A snake for a tongue. You are so bad at this. Would you rather have a snake for a tongue? Awful. Or lobster claws for hands? Sure, this could be just long ago in the I've seen that kind of thing too. Context of the crotch zoom, the other comments, and the porn music playing. There's no room for that. Keep pretending. No, I said the crouch. The the crouch. The crotch zoom is is bad. And the comments about giving him something special. That is. That's, that's bad. That's really bad. Um. If, if it wasn't for those, you could totally say, hey, the porn music is because they're playing this as a joke. It's, it's like the joke. It could be... Imagine there's all the hostesses and there's one that's really old or really ugly. Or, uh, or being a Japanese game could also be a man dressed up as a woman. <laughs> that could totally happen. Uh, <laughs> and uh, and it would still have the same music, even if your intention was just get me out of this. <laughs> Hello, Melty. How are you? Can I control this snake, or does it have free reign? Free reign. Well... I'm thinking. Think harder. And how exactly do you think harder? Good point. I'll think about that. Snake tongue. Gross. What? How is it more gross than lobster hands? Well, for one, it's in your mouth. Hey, you asked the question, Haas. Okay. How about... Oh, never mind. I probably ought to stop bugging you with stupid hypotheticals. Oh, come on. You'd be a lot less fun. You've been a lot more fun lately. Feeling better? I guess I am. Well, you sure do look better. Though, uh, you gotta admit anything is an improvement. That came out wrong. What I mean is... I mean, uh, you were... You were, uh... You know. Take a hike, Big Ears. I resemble that remark. You resemble a satellite. You know, you weren't so damn sassy before. Yes, that's a good sign. I mean it, though. After we found you, you were still so hooked on that stuff. Well, I never thought you'd make it. You ain't out of the woods yet, I know, but... Well, you've come a long way, Bonnie. And I'm proud of you. Actually, I would be willing to bet that there's some guy dressed as a woman or an old lady as a hostess in at least one of those Yakuza games. I love your uh, Kunai Plus and Seppens like old time countless Japanese games and media. Stop swinging a joke when it's so constant that it's obviously some pervy fundamental element of the culture. What do you want me to do? Change the culture? It is what it is. Play it if you like it. <laughs> yeah, I'm a real poster child. I could see you on a brochure. Oh, like the ones at the dentist? Before and after, with the puffy face and the yellow teeth. Oh, I'm not it's pretending. Now. Look, <laughs> you know I ain't going nowhere, right? As long as we're together, I'll be there for you. You ain't gotta worry. You know that, right? What are you saying? Bonnie, yeah. Leland? Bonnie? D. Hey, honey. I found us something. What are you two up to? Just chatting. Chatting, huh? What about? Oh, um, uh, well, um, lobsters. Lobsters? Well, fishing. Figured it'd be worth a shot. 
for the food, you know. Leland, you hate fishing. That ain't totally true. And how many days you gone fishing? What? I go fishing all the time. Caught you, didn't I? I am a catch. Oh, I know it. I got you a present. Oh, you shouldn't have. What'd you find? I'll tell you later. I don't mean to interrupt your chat with your uh, girlfriend, but uh, we gotta get moving. Culture is what it is, but the fact that you try to explain it away, pretend it's not where it is every time it comes up, is what's hilarious. The, the thing is, uh, we're judging something that we are not part of uh, from an outsider perspective. Uh, maybe I excuse it too much, but I do think uh, you take it very literally. We're probably both wrong, and the truth is somewhere in the middle, but um, there's really no way to know. So, like I said, it's it's always it always comes down to play it if you like it, don't play it if you don't, <laughs> right? Who cares? <laughs> what? But. But nothing happened. It's just conversation, right? You are literally an SJW for Japan. I am not. I would I like I I'm not going out of my way to defend anything. Am I making posts about Japan? On Twitter? You can see clearly except when it's your own culture. No, my culture is not Japanese. I thought I was part of the tuna culture. What's, uh, what's this about? I don't know if Japan puts tuna on pizza, man. So... Gotcha. <laughs> Where'd you get the bag, D? D? D, did you hear me? What's in the bag, D? I told you, it's a surprise. Hey, D, when we get back to camp, would you let me borrow some of that nail polish? Sure, hon. You like this color? It's my favorite. And after today, I could use a new coat, you know? Same here. I feel like a drowned rat with these claws. Not to interrupt the girl talk here, but uh, D, that, that bag. Look, I found it down the road a piece, all right? Where down the road? Some place off that away. Damn it, D, you gotta give us more than that. Is anyone there? I don't think so. You don't think? Or you don't know. Those mean the same thing, Leland. Just tell us, baby. You guys sure gang up on me a lot lately. Honey, that ain't true. Tell me one time you sided with me in the last week. The last month. All right. I can't remember one especially, but I know I have. False. This is how all our fights go. Every time. Now we're standing here in the woods, soaking through, and for what? Don't you want to get to the camp before dark? I ain't the one who stopped. We should get moving But you now. are Come the on, one who made me dark. stop. Here, regardless, we could just as easy carry on like this while we're walking. Oh, I've about had it with that attitude. Attitude? And now we're standing in this goddamn rain. You're gonna draw rain, every damn thing from miles around you. Goddamn middle of nowhere you did place. That on purpose. You listen to me now. I have had it up I to here with listening to you. To blaspheme. I can't believe you are still religious. Oh, forget the both of you. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please. We can sort this out. Oh, Lord, give me strength. We'll straighten this out. We will, right, D? We, we can solve this out. We just need to get somewhere else. Oh, now you agree with me. Bonnie, darling, I'm, I'm sorry we're... Darling? D, come on. Save it. I know what side your bread is buttered on. Yours, too. D, now's not the time. Whatever issues we got, we'll hash them out later. What are you saying? You know exactly what I'm saying. Well, come on now. Dude. Hey, even the Pope oh, has uh, made those records public, hasn't I'm he? Sorry, I just want to get somewhere where I can change my clothes, and then you and your girlfriend can 
Also slapped someone. Oh no. Oh god, run, come on, we gotta move. What are you talking about? Oh shit. Stop going so fast! You're not like the new Pope, you're one of the old. School for <laughs> why? Maybe just like have you have you ever heard of this um, beauty is in the eye of the beholder? Maybe perviness is in the eye of the pervert. <laughs> he actually that's a, that's totally true when I worked in um when I worked in a, in the Catholic newspaper I used to work in um I've had, I had something happen that, that I thought was like, holy shit, this truly is um, the definition of, of like of this, like perviness being in the eye of the pervert. Where are you? Because we were selling some some postcards. There were postcards uh, painted by foot by artists who did not have hands or couldn't use their hands or something like that. Um, but one of them was like, was a really, really well painted uh, postcard of two polar bears. Um, and, and basically it was what to give killer foot jobs. <laughs> foot massages um, so it's like imagine a snow field and then there's a, a a polar bear lying lying on his belly and then like there's a small cub like climbing over the the big one but from behind and I had looked at that before and thought it was cute and then, um, and then this, the the priest that ran the newspaper uh, came up to me with the um, with a postcard and was like, "Oh, we shouldn't be selling this, don't you think?" And I was like, "Uh, why?" He's like, "Oh, it's so inappropriate. Look, look what uh, what it looks like." And I did notice, then I did notice, like, okay, maybe it looks like the, the, the small bear is fucking the, the, the big bear, but, but no, it doesn't, you don't, you wouldn't, you would never think that. When kids are involved, that shit ends. Yeah, but that's not a kid. It's a virtual character. No one's getting hurt. It doesn't matter. You're also killing people in video games, aren't you? How many people have you killed in video games? I just, I, I don't, don't play that, don't do that mission. In the 16 Resident Evil 6 looks like giraffe, uh, giraffe getting a blowjob, it does. I, I just, I literally don't care about this, uh, about whatever this is. 
It doesn't bother me. Maybe it will when I play it. <laughs> I have not eat wait no I did eat a cake today grandmother's cake Ah, no. Right. He did a Polish sausage place a while back. Uh, throw. The thing is... It's not... The game? is just a game. What you're saying is actively seeking it out. Don't play that mission. Don't do it. Shit, get shit on the trophy. If someone tells you, hey, you don't have the platinum for this, you can tell them, hey, I did not agree with this, uh, with this mission. So, I didn't get the plat and I didn't buy any other games in the series. What's everywhere? No, no, I'm telling you to not continue. I, I'm not telling you to go back to return it. Where are you? Well, side missions that series is questionable, aren't questionable. But hey, if someone is going to be uh, a perv and hurt people, it's better that the drawings or whatever are out there and they do that. Because at least that's not a crime. And doesn't hurt anyone, like I said. Like, it's like the pyro guys that go join the fire department and fight fires instead of doing them. Sure, do that. Being an evil piece of shit is always a choice. Damn it. I remember that this, so I try not to hit her. Your dad from a smack with a flashlight? Apparently. Hey, if the rock hits you with a flashlight, you bet you're gonna d be dead. Why do, do 
do? Do I love you? How bad is it? Why didn't you say anything? You, you should have said something. You, you did this. Oh, God, you killed me. You, you killed me. Anybody see anything? I should it's never have trusted you. Just, just a junkie. Leland. <laughs> To me. I, I didn't mean to do this, D. I swear to God, I didn't. Yeah, she me. kills you with a flashlight. You love him. I saw seeing him. Look at you. I, I, no, God, I'm sorry. I need him. I need you both. You bitch. him. Yeah, I, I actively tried to not uh, hit her. Because I knew it was her. Leland is just a friend. I didn't mean to do this, D. I swear to God. You fucking junkie. Right out. It can't be far. D. D. Did you find her? Honey, I, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? Please. God, what happened? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D. Darling, what happened to you? Your face? Her face, Bonnie. I had to. I, I thought you would... Would... What do you mean, Bonnie? What was that you just said? It really was an accident, Leland. It, it really... You did this? You did this to my D? She came out of nowhere. I thought she was one of them. I, I didn't see her until she was right there. I don't... I don't believe this. I don't understand. How did it happen? Chef, you see something? There weren't nothing I could have done. It was dark and she... She came out of nowhere, Leland. Jesus. I, I believe you, but... I no, feel sick. Which way? There. I'm sorry. I'll do this to you, darling. I'll leave you here. Call out if you this see way. Him. We can't stay here forever. I think I saw something over here. Just there's a choice we made: keep failing or beat our face in. Yeah. I guess the only choice is be honest or not. What the hell are you doing? If she's gonna die for this thing, I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. Arrow, uh, when we play, we're going to be on Melty's server, right? Brought it up because I thought it was another funny example of Japanese culture being weird. I expected this to be five second. Ah! Ooh. Conversation. <laughs> Insanity and excuse making is what turns this into an hour long drama. <laughs> well, I'll only say okay next. <laughs> No, there's a lot to criticize about uh, about Japan. And m actually, it's like I said, I do think you play it up a bit too much, but I I do agree that they over-sexualize uh, kids and um, sometimes with weird... Not weird, with... Uh, I don't know. Something worse than weird excuses. Uh, excuses that don't fly at all. Like, because this, this is the stuff that I do not, uh, totally do not approve of. 
when I've seen an anime show, I've, I've seen, I've, I haven't watched it, but I know it exists. An anime show that's just like, hey, here's a, a, a 2,000 year old demon, but she's in a 7 year old body and we over sexualize it to hell and back. That, sh that shit's a no no. And um, and I really hate how Japan. On the on another note, Japan kills uh, dolphins and whales like they 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 kill countless numbers of dolphins every year, and and I I really really uh, think that's like one of the worst. Uh, well, it's infuriating, like you said. Infuriating. <laughs> I mean, but one of us will kill the other one die. <laughs> well, thank you for the bits, and I hope you're the one that dies. I mean, what? <laughs> it mad how I be letting shit get me down? Huh? Everything is temporary in life, and shit happens. Arty. You, you don't even have how, don't even have an idea how much shit really is temporary. That's, that, but that way of thinking is basically how, how I've been, um, living m most of my adult life, like, I, I remember the shit that I used to be super depressed about, and I think, holy shit, I was stupid. So, if something is getting me down now, I gotta tell myself I'm being stupid and I shouldn't care. <clears throat> Dolphins are rapists. <laughs> they are. <laughs> <laughs> Some of them are good people. They might be good, but they I don't think they're people. <laughs> you guys heard it? I, he hopes I die. Yes, if it's between you and me, I'm sorry, but I'd rather you go. I still have many years ahead of me, and you're an old, an old man. <laughs> You've already experienced the entirety of the 19th and the 20th century. What do you want? You've lived a full life. Does your father it only make sense that I would die before my child? Exactly. Actually, I've, I've thought of that before. If I die, you guys will never know. We, we always say that this person or that person is dead that stopped streaming. But one day that's actually going to be true. Wait. Throw could live to be two hundred. Never know. He already has. What do you mean? I don't. I don't understand this throw. Your sister's getting pretty good. Echo. Huh? I mean. <laughs> Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this? What do you think that does to a kid? She's already changing. She dismisses things she cares about so easily. I guess you kind of have to when you've already lost so much, but I still worry. Beck is a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... Thanks, Stephanie. Thanks. <laughs> Becca, that was great. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? That sounds like a great idea. 
Maybe we can all get in on it, like some kind of weekly talent show. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a Sorry. band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Okay, let's get to it. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Okay, but be careful. People's lives depend on those. We can't have them screwing up because we got lazy. Shell, when you get a sec, meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. Probably I'm just being stupid. I'm kind of stupid hurting my hands. With a guitar? Yeah, you can't overdo it. I mean, but who am I to say? I couldn't do a, a hand position and I gave up. Saying that doesn't make me now think about all the stupid I've really been stupid about. <laughs> I was nearly convinced I was going to be a father a few weeks ago. I, I think I remember you saying that. Um, but yeah, like, that's, a, that's another thing. It's out of your hands. After it happens, after you've, you've already fucked up, if you're not careful, if you don't uh, dress, dress up the monkey, then, um, then it's out of your hands. What uh, what uses it to worry? Just come up with a to a solution if uh, if there is a problem. Like, what would you act actually do? And whatever happens, happens, right? No use. It's it's one of those things. No use worrying. Like I go over. Sometimes I remember like how. How uh, how much I was in the dumps with uh, with my last real relationship, and I and I was like, why didn't I just cut this loose? I I was miserable. I felt miserable. I worried about it all the time, and I was like, and now I'm like, shit! I was so stupid. I was miserable because I wanted to be. People watching you 24-7. You have me on PSN, but um, I could just stop playing games. You don't know. You can also check the weeb sites for name David to appear. Might be the only one. I think c Nighter would be the only one. You see the worldwide anyway. Consumption rate plummet by 50% overnight. Well, now that David has passed from the surf. Um, if only, if only I had time to watch anyway. We should, we should do the tuna times, create it. Random friends will say something on Twitter. Mm. The only way to know is on Facebook. So if anything, uh, Echo could stalk me on Facebook. I think we're friends. Scary sauce. Sick and tired of running downstairs for alcohol. Mini fridge is getting cracked out. <laughs> Who's paying for all this alcohol, Artie? Oh no, what did I do? Most of it is mine. Facebook. <laughs> I think it's the only place where people would have to would act actively be informed. These knives are looking pretty ragged. About Boring. my passing. List. Hi. 
How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. What did Roman want? I don't know yet. Are you gonna find out? Yeah, in a sec. Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. My child, I love you, and I would follow you into the nine circles of hell if needed be. I will not touch Facebook. That's fine. That's why I said Echo would go on Facebook. You guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. I I think Echo is the only one here that's my friend on Facebook. Hey Becca, think we should start charging for the inspections we make? Oh yeah, then we can spend all our money at nowhere. Sounds great. We should do an inspection on these. Make sure they all work. God, what I wouldn't give for a cup of coffee in the morning. This hasn't worked in a long time. Smells good. It's because I'm a good friend. <laughs> you you might also be the only one uh, that has a Facebook account here. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. I don't miss going on raids for this stuff. Ooh, starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. Just realize looking at an empty bottle here, recommend units of alcohol a week is 13 or 14 a week. 24.5 in two days. Oh, Working on that record, huh? He's hungry. Guess he knows it's feeding time. Disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best. It's really not. This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. What's that one eating? I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that suit. I don't know who that is either. Those are rookie numbers. You see, I, I can't believe that. And, and, and I, I've seen that a lot lately, I think, on Twitch. People saying how much they drink, like, like it's cool, you know? Like, I'm so cool, I just drank this much. Even if that's not, um, what they're trying to say, it's like understated. Who's the drummer for Lance Zeppelin? Look up how he died. Is it alcohol poisoning? Don't think it's cool unless I'm not doing my dad. You're a lewd man, Artie. Kinky.
What? Oh shit. For a, for a second there, I thought you were talking about your dad, Artie. Not to start this behind bullshit again. So dude popped out. That's how I could date such a young girl. He challenged me to a race. I beat him in the race. He said because I beat him, then he approves of me dating the young girl, his daughter. But sure, not understanding the culture. Nope, you seem to be understanding it right. And that's just icky and wrong and shouldn't be in the game. I'm lewd. Nothing with drawn symptoms. Did you maybe not understand why I said you're lewd? Was I supposed to do something here? Do not understand, no. Ah. Because you said you were out. I, I was. I just spaced those words. You were out doing your dad. And I was like, loot. <laughs> oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again. Whoa, what's your problem? I do this all the time. You don't get all pissed off. <sighs> you just, you can't go jumping out at people. Not anymore. It's not safe. But what if I had a weapon? I could have thought you were a walker. What are you talking about? I, <sighs> look, I. I just saw our walkers out back, eating a, a puppy. A puppy? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was, it was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but after a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right. But then, you know, there it is. You see it, and you want to protect it, and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better watchdog anyway. Becca. Shell! Becca! Something's going on outside! What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. Every time David's away, I will have a shot. Ooh, no, no. I will not be weave then. I will not make this happen. We'll only speak English. And, uh... Morica! Yeah! You were born after 2000? Fuck, Artie. We gotta find Roman. God, what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. What did he take? Food, medicine, whatever he could get his hands on. Usual stuff. I couldn't get any other information out of him. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck it's in. The second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. They got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some. I'm sending him on his what way. What if there are more of them? He could have been scouted. That's right. He could be part of a larger if group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. We can't just let him go. It's too dangerous. Who knows if he has friends waiting to attack? Don't you think we would have seen someone by now? At least trying to negotiate to get him back. You don't know that. It does make sense, though. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. 
And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. He deserved Vernon it. And the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. We stole their boat from that teenage kid at gunpoint. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Jesus Christ. Are you serious? Roman's right. It's gotta be one or the other. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. <coughs> we know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. What's it gonna be? Fine. I guess this is what we have to do. There's gotta be another way. Tell me, what if he comes back? With weapons, or, or a gang? Is it worth losing any one of us? <sighs> Jesus. There really is no other choice, is there? We can't keep him here, and we can't let him go. Let's mop them. If there's even so a chance of him coming back, or telling folks that might try to hurt us, we can't risk it. I won't ask you to watch, but if we do this, we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. Why use a bullet? Makes noise. Just stab him. Do you have any fours? Nope. Do you have any sevens? Yep. Can't I cheat? I miss playing guitar for everyone. I mean, it was <clears> stupid, <throat> but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. And he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. Damn it, Becca. Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. We can talk here. No. Just finish up here and come find me. And don't take too long. What was that all about? I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. I procured a case of cider from the cold garage of Aaron's. I don't think they sh they'll sing about that. I'm sorry. But you can sing about it. Toss a coin to your RT. You know, I have not watched the show. 
Although I know that the song there's a song with that name. <laughs> hey. Shell. It's Stephanie. What? Roman's got her locked up like some kind of animal. They said she was trying to escape. They actually used that word. Escape. Boyd, calm down. I knew something like this was going to happen, Shell. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. And now look where we are. I'm gonna go talk to Roman. No, no, just take Becca and get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things are good here. We just have to stick together and follow the rules. Just don't do anything stupid. Looks nice, Boyd. <clears throat> I would wait for season two to come out. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna watch it. Hey, I heard about Stephanie. Why did she have to do that? We're safe here. There's no reason to want to leave. I'm sure she had her reasons. I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Is this really necessary? Roman? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She screwed us, Shell. All of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You do know why I'm telling you this, right? You said that next time, it'd have to be one of us. You went along with it last time. But you weren't convinced it was the right thing to do. Now I need to know that you're with us. A hundred percent. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. When she tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo. She knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. God, what do I tell Becca? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. <sighs> Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? It's Stephanie. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there, in the drawer. You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Besides, 
You know the rules. If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. Shell. I don't ever want to put you in danger. If that means this is what we have to become, then it is what it is. Sorry. Me too. So, there's a final chapter, right? Yeah. The 400 days, exactly. We were right. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. <laughs> My name is Tavia. How did you find us? Octavia? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but... I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. I heard rumors about these places. This guy I was traveling with ditched me trying to find one on his own. He thought, you know what? Let's do this. She looks well fed, right? And clean? We could all use a meal and a hot shower. Wait, do you find survivors? Do you find a lot? Not as many anymore, but... Well, we gotta go. Eddie might be there. Why? Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group, or split up, or whatever. 
but I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. Jill, why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were going to defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. What will it take to convince you? I don't know. Russell, come on. I don't understand what the problem is. Are you really considering staying out here? Foraging for food like fucking raccoons? I mean, then why did we even leave the photos there? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. You clearly outnumber me. If you wanted to overpower me, you could. Hell, I'll even go along as your hostage until you feel safe. No one is gonna hurt you. That's not a bad idea, actually. And I'll do it. Because I know when you guys see this place, you'll change your minds. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? Yeah, I'm going. Yeah, I have to. I'm... I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I and mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart... That's what's keeping us alive. Some of you may have been separated from friends or family. It's a long shot, but there's a chance you could find them there. Have your people been through Statesboro? Yes, I think we have. Okay, but I swear to God, if you try anything, you're gonna regret it. We'll do everything we can to help you find your friends and family. But understand that I can't promise anything. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? I give you my word. Yeah, I got them all to season two. Alright! Oh, what? No! I didn't! I thought she said yes! She's always the hardest one to convince, isn't she? 
Russell too. Russell is hard to convince. All right, we are done with Walking Dead season one. So I'm going to take a quick break and then come back and play season two. But and apparently I got to replay some some part of 400 days because I missed the trophy. There is a random trophy out there. But hey, I'm going to take a break and I'll be right back to do season two.